This video was made possible by EA Game Changers. Hi guys, Rachel Up here. Welcome to another Sims Mobile video. In this video, I'm going to be walking you through the stylist career. So I'm going to show you what you unlock and how it plays out and all the text as well. This is the latest career from The Sims Mobile. I did start this in my quest video. It was hard to avoid because it links along with the career. So I'm going to insert that footage now from there. Excuse the bad audio. And then I'll come back from this point because um, she's currently on part five out of 10. So I'll come back to this point when we reach it in that video. So we need to place this which cost 2,720 simoleons and two llama zoom tokens. And then I tap that and now I can choose this story. Wow, this screen looks really nice actually. So what story should we tell? Definitely this story. You do need to have done a story previous to this. Oh, you can see you've done one out of 10 things. This is it. After years of having my own Llama Tube channel, I'm ready to become a professional hair and makeup stylist. Mm -hmm. I need to become a junior stylist. This is the first part. And I'll work my way up to that. How much for saving it? Double newbie! Fab! Ah! Good boy! Mm -hmm. Ooh, chapter complete. We got the beauty cat. What you got? Yeah. Yerbly. Oh. It's great to meet someone else so passionate about hair and makeup. I watch your channel. I watch yours too. I loved your six-part series about undercuts. Oh yeah, undercuts. More like underrated. Haha. <laughs> Dad jokes never go out of style. Because then you've got the become hair therapist. Story chapter. Swab do. Swabs. I love what you did with them. You'll have to go back and pause because I'm I'm so used to just tapping through. I forget to read things out. I love what you did with them. Seems like they did too. I think you built up a loyal clientele pretty fast. I hope you're right. I'm going to need a bunch or just a few with really fast Okay, we got the straight edge asymmetrical. on part three already. You're a great listener. People love that in a stylist. It's like discounted therapy. Style is therapy. I love helping others. I love helping others feel their best. Yeah, we're basically angels with blow dryers. I placed some of the items as well. Um, this is one of them with the hairdryer on, and this is another one, this shelving over here. <laughs> Oh, I have to do the story chapter. Hey, wait a minute. That client I had yesterday gave me a bad yap review. One star? That is terrible. Yikes. We've all been there before, don't worry. Can't please everybody. You're right. I'm not try I'll try not to obsess over it. I still can't believe this bad art review. There's not even any punctuation in it. They must have been so upset that they forgot. Relax, they're probably one of those trolls who leaves everyone a bad review. They gave a 10 star review to a public toilet. <laughs> okay, welcome back. So I'm just going to finish up what she's doing. Oh, let's do that as soon as we're doing a quest. I mean, not quest. Oh my goodness, a career. <laughs> okay, the next story chapter. 
Become updo guru. You did a great job today. I hope you're not still hung up on that bad one bad yarp review. It just makes me wonder if I'm cut out for being a stylist. Eesh, don't take this the wrong way, but you might not be if you take all the bad reviews to heart. Cosmetologist in Crisis, chapter complete. That's six out of ten. Our wedding party clients are almost here. This could be your chance to earn some good reviews. You're right, I need to stop wallowing and start contouring. That's the spirit, I'm going to wheel the hairspray keg in. Okay. Next chapter, become benevolent beautician. Our wedding clients looked so happy. See? This is why I got into styling. I think we really helped make their special day even more special. True. Everyone knows the order of wedding day it importance is hair, makeup, shoes, cake, spouse. Updo Guru, chapter complete, and we've unlocked this pristine pompadour. Okay, and we've already got this straight edge asymmetrical. I need to show you these. So that looks like a female and this is a male. So we'll just put this female one on her. And we got the dryer chair. Which I thought is what we were using. Oh no, we're using the stylish chair, right? <laughs> and we've also got these two things which I've already shown you. So we'll place that dryer chair. That'll help us with events. Now we're on part 7 of 10. You really, you relate really well to clients. I can see why they trust you. Learning how to make myself look better helped me feel better inside too. That's why I want to share. That's what I want to share with them. That's sweet. Hmm, I like helping people, but I also like playing with their hair. Okay, let's go into Cass. Straight edge asymmetrical. Well, that's not even in there. At this point, I don't even know what's occurring. Ah, uh, right. I'll check for those again at the end, otherwise I'm going to have to just report those as missing. Let's go to work and place the dryer chair. 85 sim cash. I really need to like do a remodel. <laughs> okay, oh my goodness, if you want the other colours, it's an extra five. That's not too bad, I suppose. Wonderful! That's all those items placed and that should give us a boost as well when we start the next shift. And I'm hoping that those items, those hairstyles will show up maybe at the end, I don't know. I'll check again at the end. Okay, next chapter event is become popular contourer. I love the cut you did on that client who had the nasty breakup. They looked like a whole new person. Thanks, yeah, good riddance to the old them and their old ex. Sometimes a new look is all it takes to let go of the past. Benevolent Beautician, chapter complete. Now we move on to eight out of 10. Just got a call for you about a new client booking, but you're all full for the week. What, that can't be right. It's a nice problem to have, right? Maybe we can keep the salon open a little longer to accommodate your popularity. Sure. She says, doing a one hour, 50 minute shift. The next chapter is become a glam groomer. Wow, one of the looks you shared on Simstagram is getting a lot of love. 
Hey, wait a minute, I shared that months ago. That's a pic of the client that gave me the one star Yarp review. Looks like a Simstagram celebrity posted it. Is he fabulous as sister? More fabulous. People are going nuts over it. Okay, so we just got this styling and profiling outfit for male and female Sims. I know she's wearing that right now to work in. But I can now make her wear, like, wear that all the time. I can't believe that look is getting so much attention. I thought that one star review would end my career for sure. It really just goes to show that beauty is in the eye of the beholder and also celebrity opinions account more. Thank goodness for celebrities. Yay. Okay, and the next chapter story is become celebrity stylist. I just got a call from the public access channel. They want to do hair and they want us to do hair and makeup for a big televised gala with Mo Fabulous. Wow, first public access, then regular access. This is really going to put our salon on the map. I couldn't have done it without you. Story complete! And we got the Mohawk updo. Wow, that's cool. So I'm looking for the Mohawk updo and the straight edge asymmetrical. That's now ticked off. I'm gonna go and see if I can find these freaking hairstyles. Let's check my outfits for my salon. I don't think I have that either. Actually, it might be in my 925. And it's not. We can see it here, look. Okay. Oh, it says I have to pay for it. Well, I shouldn't have to because I've unlocked it. Have I not? Oh my goodness, I'm very confused. I'm going to contact the gurus and finish this video later because I think that might be a bug or something. I don't know. I'm going to try and get this fixed and finish this video. Okay, so um, I have found the items that you unlock. I do have them. I was very confused for a second and then I was reminded that you actually buy the items. I don't remember when this came in as a thing but so when you unlock your work outfit you will then find it in the shop not in your closet because you have to pay for it even though you've just worked to unlock it. I think it's disgusting actually. Um, I know you kind of do that it's kind of natural and obvious to do that with the things in the inventory but it doesn't feel like it's natural within cast maybe because of this new layout it just seems really unnatural um but yeah so this is the new outfit that comes with the stylist career i really like it there's no doubt about it i do like the things that you unlock that's certainly not up for debate but also in the shop in the hair and makeup salon hair section we can see the new hairstyles that you unlock which again you will have to purchase so this is actually oh hang on this is a bug that i'm getting with the silhouette so please ignore that so this is one of them the straight edge asymmetrical this is one of the new hairs um, and again you have to pay but not just <laughs> Not just for one, for each colour you have to pay. Um, so these are the different colour options. And yeah, you've worked through that career to gain the privilege of unlooking this hair that made her eyebrows go funny then. I like that you can zoom right in, that's cool. So yeah, thank you so much for the privilege, Sims Mobile. <laughs> I'm going to go with that one. Actually, I don't think I even want that one because I really like the Mohawk. This is another one that we've unlocked, the Mohawk updo. I really, really, really like this one. I think it's definitely, well, it stands out, doesn't it? But again, you have to pay for that and you have to pay per colour. Interesting, this one doesn't change the eyebrow colour as they usually do. I mean, if you went to a stylist with hair like this, I wouldn't know whether to be happy or run away. I might go with the pink. Wow! So the the normal colours are 930 
And then when you get into other colours, they're one, two, three, nine. Wow. I actually really like the lilac y colour. I'll get that then. Treat myself. Okay, so those are some of the things she's unlocked. And now they're in my closet. But only one colour is in my closet. Oops. And if I want the other colours, I have to pay for them. And it's full price. Anyway, I'm not bitter. Why are her eyebrows now blue? Anyway, whatever. At this point, I'm over it. I'm so disappointed. I, I don't know if you can tell, but I just think it's disgusting that you work through a quest and you work through a career to unlock some to unlock something, but then you have to pay for it. Like, that's ridiculous. Anyway, the men's hairstyle, again, is in the shop. And a hair. And it, it is... This pristine pompadour. Lovely. And again, available in different colours, cheaper than the, the female one, cheaper than the mohawk, um, more expensive in the not average colours, I guess. I think I might give him that one. And now that's in my closet, but only one, of course. That button's really small. Right, okay. That is... So that's the quest. Um, so that's the career. I'm really disheartened. Um, are the things you unlock. Like, I love the career. Love the animations. Love the interactions. Love the hairstyles. I think they're absolutely awesome, but everything is overshadowed by the fact that it's constantly asking to pay for stuff now like constantly there's nothing I can do without paying and I just think it's just disgusting anyway let me know your thoughts in the comments thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next video bye